All right, what's going on, everybody? My name is the Radio Fox or Zero Fox, whichever one you want to call me, and we are back here with another video. So in today's video, I'm doing a review video for this controller right here, the Cinch Gaming controller. Um, really, I've never really had a controller like this, uh, so I can't compare it to like Scuff or anything else like that. But I will say that I have enjoyed the controller and. Uh, I do have certain buttons on the back. This one right here is supposed to be for like uh, jumping, reload, melee, and then switch weapon. I just basically went with the the button layout here. And uh, personally, I I can't I can't figure out which way to put the controller. Sorry. Um, but I will say that I I do have a problem with adjusting to the controller. I think that's the only one issue that I do have with this whole thing. And uh, personally, it's gonna take me a long time to adjust to it. And once I do, I think everything, I will enjoy the controller even more. And that's not the controller, it's just me. I do have a hard time adjusting to controllers, especially since I've used one of these pretty much the whole entire time I had my PS4. So, I think I do have the rumble or the battery pack in here. I just don't know because I, when I, when I unplug the controller, sometimes it, it shuts itself off, which is weird. And I, when I just had it off, or I just had it on, and then I went and shut it off because I wanted to, you know, be able to touch the buttons and without, you know, hitting anything on here. So, really. I wanted to bring you guys a video and talk to you guys about that. Um, I like the fact that I can keep my fingers on the joysticks as I'm playing and not have to worry about, you know, taking my right thumbstick and, you know, switching the, you know, hitting the button. And the, the thing that I feel is that I like the grip. I love the grip. It feels comfortable. The whole entire thing is comfortable. I don't feel like I'm you know falling all over the place with the controller you know yeah but really I, I like the controller I think I got the the trigger stops that are internal I believe I don't remember um, personally I just I feel like the controller is uh, is a brand new me um, I mean I haven't I I've been playing a lot of Call of Duty over the past couple of months and really going from this, you know, where when I'm playing and my hands are sweating, I'm all over the place, you guys. And really, personally, that's the number one issue that I have. And I think that's why I went with this. I do have raised thumbsticks, so that way when I'm playing, I don't have to really worry about, you know, constantly moving the joysticks over, kind of like what this one was. I did have control freaks there for a while. And personally, I prefer the raised thumbsticks over anything. Um, I can't, I can't dog this controller. It's a nice controller. It's uh, it's comfortable. The buttons are, you know, in a good spot. I just feel like my fingers hit the wrong buttons all the time, and and it, that's just me. I, it's gonna take me a while to adjust to, and that's the number one problem that I have. And it's not the controller. It's not the, you know, the feeling of the controller. It's just me. It's me adjusting to the controller. So, I I can't express how much this controller has helped me as a gamer. Um, I I play a lot of Call of Duty. I do a lot of sniping. I do a lot of uh, you know other things that you know help me in Warzone and everything else so that's the reason why I went with the uh, sense controller and a buddy of mine who's who has like a scuff and a, a sense controller he prefers the sense over you know the scuff and really I don't know I couldn't tell you because I have never owned a scuff controller but I will say that I do enjoy this controller a lot um, I, I have no bad reviews on it personally and that's just me but uh, I'm not gonna tell you guys to you know 
go order it and then not like it. But if you guys do want to order one, go down to uh, cinchgaming.com and they will they will uh, hook you up. And that's the number one thing that I wanted to address today. And this is uh, probably not going to be a super long video, guys. But uh, if you guys could, just go check them out. You know, look at what they got. If you want to order one, then be my guest. Um, they're a little expensive, but that's fine because it was well worth it in the end and uh, stuff. So I am going to end the video here, guys. Again, I highly recommend it. This is something that I highly recommend. And I've been streaming and gaming for a long time. Going from controllers like the red one you saw to what you guys are saying right here so personally I enjoy it it's gonna be it's gonna come in handy in the end so just uh, go check out the link I'll leave it down in the description guys and I'll see you guys very soon with another video I'm Zero Fox of the Raging Fox and I'm out see you soon guys